Hi teachers, this is Brandy Caldwell with Alabama Technology in Motion. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about a Chrome extension that's super helpful while you are doing your remote learning. And so you're going to start out at the Chrome Web Store and then you're going to search for the extension. This particular one is called the Evernote Web Clipper. There are several other web clippers out there. If you are a OneNote user, this one might be preferred, but I'm gonna use the Evernote one because I already have an account with Evernote. Um, if I did not have it installed, it would have an install button right here. But um, once you install this, it will show up in the top toolbar as this little green elephant. So we are going to now go to a website that I would like to um, clip. And so once I've got that site loaded, now this particular site I had to reload because I had just installed this um, extension. And once I click the extension, a little sidebar is going to pop up over here and ask me what I want to do. Do I want to grab the whole article, simplified article, full page, bookmark, or a screenshot? One of my favorite things is screenshot. So once I am ready, I can grab the section just by click and drag that I want to keep as a screenshot. And when I let go, it makes a screenshot for me. Okay, the other really cool thing is I can annotate this screenshot. So I'm a big fan of using arrows to draw attention to the screenshot. Um, I like the fact that I can highlight as well. And then I can write something here. So that makes it a great idea. Um, and there are several other tools that you might like. Um, you can add tags to it. So this one I'm just going to tag as ATIM. Um, if you already have an account with Evernote, you can have notebooks that you could organize this into. So I'm going to click training. Um, and then I can even give a description for this if I want. Um, lots of other things I can do. And finally, I'm just going to say save clip. It's going to save that clip. It's going to put it in my Evernote account. Now, if I don't want to go log into Evernote and see it, I can also use this button right here and copy it to my clipboard here on my computer, or I can email it straight to someone. So that makes it super handy. Um, if I want to copy it to my clipboard, I can now open a document, paste that right into my document, and work with that great screenshot. So that's one of the reasons why I love the Evernote Web Clipper. And if I click view in Evernote, I have just a treasure trove of all of my screenshots um, that I have done throughout the history of creating these. So just a great tip for you as you're doing your remote learning. And I hope that you will visit Alabama Technology in Motion and look at all the different digital resources we are providing for you. And remember, you can always contact your local technology in motion specialist.